I can get any man I want in this world. Hey everyone, it's your girl Fantana. Shout out to Yekasa TV. Yeah, welcome to Yekasa TV. I'm Jabro, aka Facebook Assemblyman, and today I have here with me one of the priors. Uh, on Facebook, he's my friend as Katal Big J. But you out there know him as Prayer, Prayer Tetia. We want to have a discussion with him and know some insights. You know, um, just have a little chit chat. We met actually at Zion Felix's birthday party where he was, he launches his, his new studio and he's celebrating his, his new age. And so, as industry folks, we came to support our brother. And I just caught up with my big man and we want to have. Bro, thanks for having time. Thank you very much. How are you? I'm good. How is the COVID uh, treating us? I mean, you and the family. As you can see, I'm all geared up like a ninja. You know, COVID is real. I mean, you all, you've seen the numbers. It rises every day. And so I'm entreating everybody to take their, their protocols, their COVID protocols very serious. As I'm doing now, we need to uh, um, 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 exercise all the, the protocols. And that's exactly what I'm doing now. You are an artist, are the, uh, uh, artist and COVID has come. How is you? How are you and your guys? Um, I mean, your group coping up with events. You know, as a music, as a group, pro providing music for, for for the people out there. Well, we all know what COVID has done, and um, I mean, we've all taken a break for a while because of COVID nineteen, and nobody is actually doing anything actively. Because when you even release anything, you need to go to radio stations, TV stations to promote it. Some are doing it, all right, but we and my crew. Uh, it, because we are we've taken we have decided to take a back seat for a while we feel this is the best time for us to relax and you know take a chill pill and then you know um like to cool off cool down a bit so that's exactly what we're doing well but very soon when by god's grace the covid numbers start dropping then we'll, we'll start coming out do you remember the last time you went on on, on an, a show to perform uh that was in december that was in december which, yeah. which show was that December to remember, uh, we did a couple of shows. We did a couple of shows, yeah. Now let's 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 talk. About respect between you the you know kind of not old school but you know you've been there and they are coming in do you think there's a respect be there's respect between the two the new guys no there's a lot that can be done you know that is one of the main reasons why i was trying to correct what Shatat was saying because the kind of things he says about us his predecessors and some of the people we all came to meet when you disrespect them when you say things like that when you ridicule them like that the upcoming boys will not give you the, the due respect that but we all came to meet people i came to meet obrafo and co i today up to today i still give obrafo the respect that he deserves as my senior in the game that's exactly how it has to be but when you keep disrespecting us saying all sort of things about us because of the fact that you think you are making it now I mean, it's because you're making it now, that's why you're getting the revenue. Yeah. That's why you're making all the numbers. Yeah. But if today your music is not being played or you're not, you're not hitting, quote unquote, you're not hitting again, you think you are going to even get that opportunity to, you know, be getting the numbers and then be calling others broke? No, you can't. So, so in a nutshell, all I want to say is, let's give respect where respect is due. The kids are watching. Let's give, let's give them a, 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 a good path for them to emulate. As as priority, do you work on solo projects alone? 
No, no, no. For now, um, our group, you know what happened to us? We split for a while and uh, by God's grace, we are back. But because of COVID-19, like I said, we've all taken a, um, a holiday for a while. So uh, in due course, you're going to hear from us again. Should fans be looking out to see uh, Priority look? Maybe probably, yes, you are in a group. We understand that there's a group. But sometimes you guys do go solo and feature some other artists. Should we be expecting that from you to, from time to time? Uh, for now, such plans are not in place. Um, I've seen a uh, couple of old folks that uh, I would use, for example, Five Five Papi, you know, make complaints about the new crop of artists with the Kwame UGs, the kiddies, and uh, the, the affiliation, the link between you guys. If, if you want to give an advice to anybody who is coming up, the upcoming artists, what would be the specific thing you would want to tell them? I think music or this internet age that we are in now, Whatever thing you put out there, remember it's going to be there for the rest of your life. And over, not even for the rest of your life, it's going to be there for generations and generations to come and meet. So, all I will say is, we are not rushing anywhere. We have done music that is standing the test of time. 17 years, I am assured they are one. And still being enjoyed and people still feel like it was released yesterday. So, when you go to the studio, make sure you are giving, you are bringing up material that you can be proud of after many years. That's exactly all I want to say. Um, you, 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 you definitely will be doing more music after this. Um, I want to know if if there's any uh, form of line should in case I one day you would want to go in for a position uh, to to straighten this entertainment industry. What would be the main key? Because you have gone through a lot as as an artist with your group. What would be the change you'd want to give into the entertainment industry? I think they should just suck everybody at. They should just suck everybody at Gamro and let's recruit professional people who have gone to school to study how to uh, manage music business, including Rex Man. They should suck everybody there. That's all. They should suck everybody there. Nobody deserves to be there. What? what what's your reason? They, they don't have the technical know-how. They don't have. They are not professionals. In, in, in music management, they should bring. I feel they should bring in professionals, those who have food, those who have the, the know how of how to manage business, uh, music and for us to make proper revenue so that we can, structures can be in place for all of us to, to, to feed from. Yeah. You, you, are, you are part of music. Uh, um, a boy going in from leaving music and going into full politics. Do you really support that? that particular decision from uh, entertainers, industry folks leaving their professions and going into a new profession. Oh no, for, for, for that, yeah. I don't, I, I see, no, I have no comments with that. There's nothing wrong with that. Every, we are all citizens of Ghana. We are all entitled to, uh, to uh, uh, whatever uh, political uh, party we want to affiliate ourselves with. So um, I, I, I will push our war, I will urge him to go all out. I urge Don Dumelo to go all out. It is, it is big. It's an industry that I feel like if they think what they, they what they have for because it's Ghana. Ghana is what we are talking about. If they think they have policies that they can, you know, they can make Ghana a, 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 a better than it is now, they should also come on board. And so there's absolutely nothing wrong with uh, celebrities or showbiz people going into into politics. They, it's been it's, it's it's seen in other countries. The other countries are doing it. There are so many people out there in the other um, part of, 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 of the world that are. are, 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 are I, I have I have seen how you 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 and your wife you rule the internet, especially Instagram with flashy pictures, um, uh, videos and stuff like that. We've now seen uh, Andrew of Kachia and his wife also doing that. Do you think that it, is, it should be a new thing for uh, musicians, entertainers to be to be flaunting their family like that for, for we, those who are observing from back? Do you, do you advise it's okay like that for us, for that to happen? I mean, for, for that flash, you know, uh, showing the love, the family out. Because some people feel like, Man, person, me fear for, uh, me fear who near my baby, do you think it's okay as, as entertainers? Oh, no, 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 there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, we're in love. What you see is what you get. We are, we, we, everybody has its own policies on how to, how you want to show their, their, their relationship out there. Me and Sally, we've been like that from day one. So there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Yes. But does anything that has to do with prior tint, uh, prior tinting and honey hole have, would, would it affect you when it comes to another split up shooting case? That's no, a, no, no, no. We're, we're, we're too grown up. So whatever decision we're making now, 
we know what exactly we are going into. So uh, I, I don't think there will be any there will be any counts if we should go our separate ways again. But for now, there's nothing like that. All right, thank you very much, Big uh, Cattle. Uh, thank you for having Hello, me. Sorry. I'm very grateful. Sharp. Yes, I just had a chit chat with uh, Big Cattle of the prior group, uh, prior tits, yeah. And we had a chit chat. Um, thank you for staying tuned. I would want you to follow us on Instagram at the Ekasa TV and as well as subscribe to this channel on YouTube. Let us give you more. Thank you for staying tuned.